Hi, I'm Leslie Hart Davidson from Hart Davidson Designs, and I have the coolest job in the world. I get to help you live better in your home through good interior design. Today we're here at Monica Harris's house, and we're going to take a look at her decor and find out how she can live better in her home. Let's take a look. Alright, so Monica, it's very obvious that you know a lot of crap. I have been told that before. That yes. Yeah, yes. This is a special kind of crap though. Okay. Yes, this is a crap that is a design language. It helps you diagnose and treat any room any style. Okay. Alright. Okay. It's an acronym. You ready for some, some learning? I am. Contrast, I am. repetition, alignment, and proximity. Okay. Alright. Okay. It's the balance of these four elements that create good style in any room. Okay? Okay. Alright. So contrast, let's talk about that one first, because you obviously got that one down. Contrast shows uh, differences between items in a room to show visual interest, and your color contrast is fantastic. It's perfect. It's just the right amount of contrast for the room. Good. Another way to get contrast is texture, and you have beautiful texture in the room. And look at this fireplace. It's fantastic. So all this, it's this beautiful rock here mm -hmm. and so many different colors in it. You just want to go up and touch it. So it's a beautiful blend of color and texture that you have in this room that okay. makes a fantastic contrast. Yay me! Yay! Good job. <laughs> All right, so repetition. It's your second element in craft. Okay. Okay. Repetition asserts a theme through multiples. But remember, themes are for parties, not for rooms. Okay. But All guess right. what? You've done an excellent job with the repetition in this room. Alignment shows hierarchy through placement because some things just need to be more important than others. There are two special elements of alignment. One is horizon decor, and the other is perimeter decor. Horizon decor is when you have every picture or accessory hung at exactly the same level all around the room. It's kind of boring that way, just like driving through Indiana. What you want is to give your eyes something to look at, to go up and down just a little bit to make it more interesting. Perimeter decor is where you have every piece of furniture shoved up against every available wall. Again, not too interesting, but if you play with your furniture on angles, it can create an interesting traffic flow and make the room look great. Proximity is all about function because you can have the most beautiful room in the world with perfect contrast, excellent repetition, and the most fantastic alignment you've ever seen. But if the room doesn't work, there's no reason to be in it.